All right, so today is the 150th day since I bought these two little red tail catfish. Been taking videos every day, posting them on YouTube so you can see how fast they grow. And it is really early. The sun's barely coming up. And I think these guys were still kind of sleeping. <laughs> they seem a little groggy. Usually they come right up to the top. Yeah, I've been hand feeding just a little bit every day. This is the second week of hand feeding. See if I can find a little bit of tilapia here. We'll see if we can get them to come up. I don't know. They seem like they're half asleep. <laughs> All right, buddy. Let's see. <laughs> they're thinking about it. So one day this week, I was actually, oh, here he comes. Maybe he's thinking about it. He can taste it. <laughs> he can taste it. Oh, they're both coming up. Ah, <laughs> all right. Nice. All right, we'll try another one. They're getting used to the hand feeding. Seems like they're kind of slow to start on the hand feeding. See if I get another piece here. There's a nice big, I think this is cod. Get a piece of cod here. see if he'll come up they're still it seems like they're still a little shy as far as coming up to hand feed i've been trying to hand feed just twice at the beginning of the feeding just to kind of get him used to it oh uh, here he comes here he comes all right here you go buddy here you go <laughs> oh he kind of got freaked out i was like i wanted to cup him in my hand just to kind of give you a perspective of how big he is. And he dropped it. All right, we'll see if we can do it again here. Maybe. Oh, all right, so that was good enough. <laughs> I usually just do two hand feedings. They came up, they came up twice, so that's fine. So from here, I usually just pull the filter out. Yeah, so the filter doesn't suck up the food. I started feeding them a little bit more. I had one day this week where it, it seemed like uh, it seemed like I didn't feed them enough, and one of them was gotten almost too much, and the other one was still skinny. And that's kind of the hard part, especially if you have these bigger chunks. So I try not to chop it too big because with the big chunks, one of them can just quickly eat. A lot of the uh, a lot of the food before the other one gets any of the food so it's always kind of a challenge keeping them big enough but not too big to where one will eat more than the other one all right so this is a combination of cod tilapia and shrimp tails that I got from the grocery store it seems like the shrimp is a little freezer burn and it kind of floats a little bit <laughs> it seems like it's they're eating it fine all right, so I'm going to finish up with some underwater video.